Good, good evening. My inspiration for my unconventional uh, cocktail for Javine is Johnny Wilkinson. Now we didn't play the same position on the rugby pitch, but I have the utmost respect for the gentleman. He's full of courage, passion, and he's one of the best leaders in world rugby. He kicked the last minute, last seconds drop goal to win us the World Cup in 2003, which will always be on my memory and a great time for English rugby and for gentlemen like me who watch the sport. So he's constantly practicing, like myself, to make the ultimate drink. He's always kicking, practicing his kicks to always score the points that are needed to win the games. Now, for my drink, he went to France, no one backed him. They thought he was injured, written off, but he proved everybody wrong and went out winning for Toulon in the, world, in the French final. So my drink is inspired for Johnny Wilkinson, so I'm going to use the ingredients from around the region and south of France. So my first drink, for the first drink, let me use that ice, 5 ml of Baz Armagnac, 1979 the birthday, birth year of Johnny Wilkinson himself. 10 mil of Vermouth Royale Blanc, which has 18 botanicals, which will pair perfectly with the main spirit of my drink, which is Javine Gin. Javine uses the grape flower, which is only blossoms for two days in the year in June, which has to be picked very fresh. So I'm gonna use 50 mil here, other botanicals include ginger roots, a bit of lemon, licorice, and obviously juniper. So it pairs perfectly with the vermouth. Then, I'm going to keep it in the region. I'm going to use 25ml of rose Bordeaux wine. And then 10ml of each fig liqueur and cassis. So there's 20ml in there that gives it a red colour that reminds us again of the English Red Rose that Johnny played for when he played for England. So we're going to give that a good stir, we're going to add some more ice, make it nice and cold. So this is going to be a perfect, a perfect drink before a meal or on the veranda in the evening after your meal watching the sunset. So a nice chilled glass, coupette. Then we see the great colour, the aromas are coming through, very floral, very zesty. And just to finish off, a little garnish on top, just to remind us that we are always the best rugby nation in the world. The English red rose on top, gives it the floral notes, and my cocktail inspiration for Johnny Wilkinson. Toi, or else, or Johnny. Three cheers for Johnny. Enjoy.